Mommy Bay is different than what comes out of your faucets at home. However, the algal bloom is prompting action at the Collins Park Water Treatment Plant in Toledo. The city announcing today that they will begin daily testing of the drinking water there. We're told this is simply a precautionary effort and that our drinking water is safe tonight. Blair Caldwell live in studio tonight to break down this filtering process of the water that comes from the lake to your home. Blair. Well, Andrew, I can tell you that it just is a few steps in your home to make sure you can get to the water. But in reality, the process is much more drawn out for the city of Toledo. Here's exactly what I mean. Most of the work done is here at the Collins Park water treatment plant, but it all actually starts over here at the Toledo water intake. That's where water comes into the lake. That's about three miles into Lake Erie. And from there, the water travels as you see right here to the low service pump station, and then it travels all the way across town to the Collins Park water treatment plant, where essentially most of the work happens, but a lot of that work happens in this red line. So let's break down exactly what that looks like. Now, as soon as water is taken off of Lake Erie, it's first treated with potassium permanganate, which removes some of the hydrogen sulfite and iron. From there, the water moves so it's at to its second location where power activated carbon is added. Water moves through the pumps all the way to the Collins Park water treatment plant where the process gets a bit more intense. First, a loom is added, which binds particles together, helping to remove toxins from the water. A number of other chemicals are added at that point, which helps soften, remove odor, improve the taste, disinfect and clean the water. Still in the water treatment plant, water is filtered and goes into a 70 million gallon holding tank underground where it sits for several hours. From here, the water moves to a high service pumps where, as you imagine, they send that now treated water to pipes that lead directly to you in your home. This process is complex and lengthy, taking about a day and a half. But Toledo's mayor says, well, you can trust that it works. And the citizens of Toledo have invested in this plant uh, so that while the water that comes in here comes from a source that agricultural interests have polluted for us, by the time it comes out and ends up in your faucet, um, it's as good a water as you will find anywhere in this country. Mayor Capsicabit says together there have been about half a billion dollars of improvements at the Collins Park water treatment plant. And right now they're working to install ozone, as you can see, which is an oxidant that essentially vaporizes organic materials from the water, further protecting it and you. Now, of course, we will continue to monitor exactly what that water looks like and bring you the latest information on air and, of course, directly to your phone. Reporting in studio tonight, Blair Caldwell, WTOL 11.